Hello everybody, welcome back to another Hoff Bergman Explained video. Today we're going to talk about a course add-on pack for Hoff Bergman version 1.5 or greater. So the mad Dr. Farmer Andy has been at it a little bit longer than simply just updating his map and adding a whole lot of new features to the final version 1.5, now updated to 1.5.0.1. We all know that horses have, well, they've been left wanting a lot for Farm Sim 22. Farm Sim 19, they were fairly profitable with respect to owning horses and then selling them after a brief time frame, but they pretty much nerfed that in FS 22. And as soon as horses were announced, lots of people, well, they wanted to do more than simply just ride a horse. And that is exactly what we have here with the horse add-on pack. Again, exclusively for Hoff Bergman version 1.5. So if we go to the shop and we go to tools, we have the Hoff Bergman horse add-on pack. Of course, we can also go down here to the mods and DLCs and find that here as well. Within this, we're going to be able to horse drawn carts. We're going to be able to draw implements with our horse. We have a hitch for a rope to drag trees out of the woods. We can put a saddle on and off our horse. And then we have a saddle stand. So let's take a closer look at all of these things in the shop. So we have our small cart, $2,300. It is available in a platform or a cart version and in the i guess bulk cart version it's going to hold 1000 liters worth of product we then have a two axle cart it's going to have a steering axle in front we can get that in a platform for forty eight hundred dollars we can get it in a cart form to hold 1.6 cubic meters or 1600 liters worth of product or we can get it in a tank form and it's going to hold 2000 liters worth of liquids. We then have an implement which is going to allow us to attach other implements to this. So we're going to attach our horse to this and then we're going to be able to attach implements to the rear. This is going to cost $1,200. And to that, we're going to be able to attach a cultivator, $450, 1.2 meter working width, a 0.5 meter working width plow, two bottom plow, and a one meter disc harrow. We also then have this tow bar, and this bar is going to be able to be attached to the horse, and then we're going to be able to use this like a winch and be able to attach a rope to a log and pull trees out of the forest. We have, of course, our saddle. $1,800. And then our stand for our saddle when it's not on our horse. So let me go and show you kind of how some of this stuff is used. So we have our saddle here on our saddle stand. We're just going to pick it up. I'm going to bring it around to our horse. And the horse is just going to, it's just going to pop on the horse. We then jump on the horse and there we are saddled. If we hit I, it is going to basically magically drop the saddle off the horse. At this point, we can pick it up and put it back on our saddle storage area. Okay. Now, in order to attach any of these trailers to the horse, you will need to have it saddled. Now we are saddled. Let's go ahead and back up the horse to this flatbed cart. When we're in position, we will get the Q. And now we have attached. So we get a yoke that shows up. We can turn on the lamp on the back. We're going to hop off the horse. And why not go ahead and put some, some bales on here. We want to strap that down. 
but good old ratchet straps wouldn't look very good on this trailer, so we have rope instead. And really well done. I like the modeling on this. All the way to having some brakes modeled. Let's hop back on our horse. Pull up the F1 menu. And there you go. We can just ride around. Then when we're done, we're just going to hit Q to detach. This trailer is pretty much the same thing, but we'll just go ahead and hook up to it. And here we can hit X to take the back off, make it easier to load. We do have the ability to strap. And then the key to turn on your headlights is what's going to turn on the lantern. So I said we have then the larger two axle. We can get it in a flatbed. We can get it in a trailer and we can get it with liquids like that now this one's nice because it does have a a steering axle so with the one axle trailers they can kind of be yanked around jerked around when the horse is turning this one's doing it a little bit but at least this one does have a little bit more freedom of motion Now, before we go and demonstrate these three implements, I want to talk to you about what do you do when you put the horse away? Well, there's there's a little bit of a, a gotcha, okay? So if we go in here and we simply put the horse away while it is saddled, uh, your saddle vanishes and you'll never see it again. So you want to make sure you take your saddle off your horse before you go and put the horse away. To do that, we're going to hit I. And then with, again, the update to Hoff Bergman 1.5, we're going to actually need to take our horse into either the stable here at the barn, at the farm, like this, in order to put the horse away. Or over at the other pin, let's go and take this over to the other horse. We're going to need to basically return our horse, not by just walking him into the pin like this, because he's not returned. We're going to have to bring him over here to this, this overhang or this, uh, this little covering. And once we're in front of this little covering area, we're going to be able to return our horse. And as you can see, he's now gone, right? We can come back over here and we can clean him. So simply riding him into this area is no longer acceptable to basically return the horse back to the pasture. Now with this horse saddled, let's go ahead and make our way over to a field where I have some things set up. So you can see here in the field, we do have our implement attacher, we'll call it. Let's go ahead and back up to that. We get our yoke, it's now attached. We're gonna be able to reverse, reverse the horse to the implement. We're gonna be able to attach it and we're gonna left click and move up and down to raise and lower the implement. So once we lower the implement, now we're just off to the horses, off to the races. And there you go. So now we are basically doing field work. 
with our horse. Now we can just hit Q to detach that. Come back around here and hook up to our plow. And we can left click, raise and lower. And off we go, plowing half meter at a time. So if you thought there were there were too few one meter plows on the mod hub, well, you can have a half a meter plow here on Hoff Bergman. And then lastly, we do have a cultivator. So one could really start pretty slow or pretty low on the totem pole with respect to machinery by getting horse-drawn machinery and using a horse to do your, your basic field work. Now let's come over here to the forest because I just so happen to have already felled a tree. I want to show you how we're going to use this to pull a tree out of the woods. So it may be a little hard to see here, but we do have the last implement we're going to talk about right here behind our horse. Again, we're going to go to Hoff Bergman add-on pack, horse add-on pack, and here it is. This is what we are looking at here, viable for $100. And we're going to basically back the horse right up to that, and we're going to get a option to attach. Once again, we get our our yoke we've got some ropes that are now connected to this a little maybe unrealistic we're just going to walk the horse backwards and we'll just leave them right here we come back here to the back we're going to get the option to hit r to grab the winch rope we're going to bring it over here to the felled tree we're going to hit b to attach and then we can also, you know, hit Y to detach if we want. But we'll go back and do this again. And this is all possible with the Platinum expansion. If you do not have the Platinum expansion, then, well, you're going to run into difficulties with respect to using this particular implement with your horse. And now you could do some pretty, pretty low-cost forestry in felling your trees, dragging them out to a clearing with your horse, and then cutting them down to size, maybe loading them on a horse-drawn flatbed, and then taking those to the sawmill. What do you think of that? Sounds like a pretty cool option. So guys, that is the horse add-on pack for Hoff Bergman version 1.5 or greater. This is exclusively for Hoff Bergman. It is not going to be available for any other map, sadly, because the horses did need to be customized with respect to the map in order to be able to use this add-on. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below with respect to this horse add-on. Is this something you're going to add to your Hoff Bergman gameplay? Maybe, quite maybe, is this maybe something that is going to cause you to maybe finally download Hoff Bergman? Arguably, I would say, probably the most interactive map for Farming Simulator 22 out there that is Hoff Bergman. Till next time, happy farming.